Hello, beautiful people. It's that time of year again where I take a moment to do some reflection. A moment to question my existence and its impact. A moment to question who I am. Twenty twenty has not been an easy year. A pandemic swept the globe, shutting down entire countries. No one could have predicted where we'd be today. A year ago, I was traveling, growing, learning about the world that existed outside of a two-hour radius around my city. And this year, I'm at home, but I'm still growing and learning about the world, and even more importantly, about myself. Somehow. Through all the chaos, creativity was inspired. I started my photography business. I elevated my craft. I tackled issues that I've always wanted to with a newfound confidence. And I learned about human connection. Anything to say to the future? Keep doing what you do. <laughs> And what would that connection be without language? My idea of language and the role it plays in our society has expanded tenfold. Without the ability to touch or to see even, what we say has seemed to garner more weight. This year, I've reached a basic level of French, truly confirming that my affinity for language learning doesn't have to do with one culture or another, but rather a larger global culture, one that exists on the basis that all of us are human. That at the very least, we have that in common. And for me, that's enough to start a conversation. So, that's who I am. I'm a creative. I'm a lifelong learner. I'm an aspiring polyglot. I'm a people person. Um, I'm happy. And I'm hopeful. I really hope you can't hear me during the background. <laughs> I have nothing but excitement for what the future holds. Holds um, for me, for you. Uh, whatever it is, it has to be better than 2020, right? And I guess, uh, I guess time will tell. Um, well, until next year, my name is Quincy Bowie, and this is who I am. <laughs>